Governor Kevin Stitt signed the Save Women Sports Act into law this morning. It bans transgender girls from participating in women's sports at all state schools and universities. Cap reporter Gus McDonald has more now from the Capitol. What we're trying to accomplish here is very, very simple. We are protecting women's sports. A current athlete from OU stood with the governor. I believe that all young women deserve the opportunity to excel at whatever sport they choose to be passionate about. OU released a statement saying in part they're committed to creating an environment of belonging. OSSAA reports no complaints have been filed on their current policy about unfairness in women's sports, but said today they would comply with the law. Lawmakers and transgender rights activists say the measure is harmful as it now goes into emergency effect. It's more than just about sports. This is a slippery slope. Bills like this have a horrifying implication and a ripple effect on our young ones. They're heartbreaking. The ACLU of Oklahoma is exploring legal pushback. This fight is not about sports. It is about erasing and excluding trans people and children in every aspect of public life. Representative Mari Turner has been a fierce opponent of the measure. You will not get rid of 2S LGBTQ plus youth or communities. You will only create an environment that is unsafe and one in which they do not wish to live. 